Hello guys and welcome back to another vlog. I'm so excited guys. Hello guys and welcome back to another vlog. It's a week of glow up. Hey guys, it's Tuesday the 6th and um, sorry I still look gross. So I've just got two packages in the mail. This is for a video, so I think I can't show you guys this, but I'm gonna open this up and hopefully, I'm not, I'm like, I'm half hoping it's something for a video, but I'm half hoping it's not so I can show you guys, so I'll have to take this out. I ordered whitening strips from AliExpress. I can't use them yet because I have my braces on. Um, I honestly thought they were going to take months to get here, so I'm actually surprised they came so quick because we're going to have to keep these sitting around for a few months. 2024, so they'll be good when I get my braces off, but stay tuned for next year when I'm doing a video on um, whitening my teeth from AliExpress teeth whitening strips. So excited guys, my hair dye has arrived. This massive box. So for anyone wondering, I ordered my hair supplies off this website called um, Carthy. Is what it's called. Okay, so this is my powder bleach. Apparently nine levels of lift. It's the Schwarzkopf. Um, this is the developer. I got a 30 developer. Be careful when you're getting developers though. If you don't know what you're doing, it's probably better to go for a lower developer. However, that might not lift your hair as much and my hair is like basically black. So yeah, I always use a 30 developer, but I would never go any higher by yourself. I would stick probably to even 20. Then this is the toner I got. So I'm actually gonna mix this, I think, hopefully it'll work with purple shampoo. So this is kind of like an icy silver shade. So I'm hoping that by mixing it with the purple shampoo, it will come out kind of silvery purple, let's see. And then I just got whoa, a light developer for the toner because I'm not gonna put a dirty developer with my toner. This was actually really cheap. This bottle was like five euro and there's a liter of it. Uh, my drawing is not great. Good morning guys, it's Friday. I am super tired because I drank a whole bottle of Prosecco last night um, in my paint and Prosecco class. However, I think my painting didn't turn out as absolutely terrible as I thought it was going to, but it came out like this, which actually I'm okay. This kind of all looks okay. The lines in the shell are terrible, but where's going on with this leg? If all the other legs were like that, it would be cool. Got this package today, and it is a like dupe for the Dyson Airwrap outside. So there was an option to buy this with a case, and I can't remember if I did. I think I didn't. I think I didn't think I needed the case because I have like stuff already, or have a little bag. Ooh, that looks really good. So I've heard a lot of good reviews about this fake one. People are saying it works really, really well. And I just kind of wanted a new styling tool for doing my hair because I don't really blow dry my hair that much. We have regular hair dryer, but this is meant to be able to make it really easy to curl your hair with the hair dryer. So yeah, just thought it could be cool. So let's see, you've got your hair dryer part here, and then you've got all different nozzles to attach here. So. I'm just gonna take everything out of the plastic. Yeah, there you go, now in full glory. It actually comes with really good amount of pieces. So there's the hair dryer part itself. It comes with two wraps. So they're for doing curls, which is one of the main reasons I wanted this. Yeah, there's a smaller one, and then this one is a bit bigger. Standard hairbrush, circle hairbrush attachment. And then you've got your hair dryer. I assume they just click on. Oh, and it just clicks into place. Oh, okay. I'm excited to use this. I'm excited, I'm excited. Hey guys, it's a Sunday night. We are going to watch Space Jam. Just for anybody watching, I have actually never, I'm ashamed to say, never seen Space Jam and David is upset that he's been in a relationship with me for eight years. And I yes, I am. Since... Forget about the rest of that <laughs> He's upset with me that I've... he's been in a relationship with me for eight years and didn't know that I didn't see Space Jam and that I hadn't watched it. So we are watching it. Guys, how nice this view. So pretty. Please excuse my ridiculous looking sunglasses. <laughs> we're just hiking up here. As you can see, uh, we're going to see Loch Tay, which is the Guinness Lake, in case you guys aren't familiar with it. This is Laura, say hi. <laughs>
that's a nice rock. Hopefully not stuck inside your seep. really fun really exciting uh, me and Laura just kind of probably fly our drones up here I'm not sure I've already used two batteries of my drone so I really hope this isn't too windy in the camera but um yeah I've already used two batteries and hopefully the last battery will last a bit because it's really windy and that kicks the battery really quickly so just here I'm behind a rock to show you where I am but now just copying Laura because she said so you can see the Poolberg over there Dublin it's like over there I think that's Ducky. I asked Laura and she said she thinks it is like Ducky Kalini over there. Oh, my hand's nowhere near Sugarloaf. Then you're into Popper, into Wicklow. Oh, little doggy. Um, but yeah, this is good. Wow, this is like way much of a windbreak. This has been a fun hike and I would give this a thumbs up if anyone is looking to do this in um, around the Wicklow area. I'm really lucky that I live on the uh, border of Wicklow, so this wasn't too far from me, which was very nice. It's very nice to meet up and do this hike and get some content. Guys, I've come home and David has finished painting the fence. How nice does it look? We're about to paint this grey pillar a kind of black colour. So I'm delighted. 